Hi everyone and welcome to the Armour All Summer Grill with me, Steve Johnson. Steve, thanks for having us here at your beach pad. Yeah, yeah, Not thanks bad. for that. <laughs> nice spot, isn't it? Talking all things motorsport across the summer break. And Steve, World Rally Championship. Gee, some big news for one of our big Aussie names. Yeah, it is. It's fantastic. You know, Chris Atkinson has been announced as a new works Hyundai driver for 2014. And we will see him here. Uh, in Rally Oz next year. It's going to be fantastic. 2008 was the last full-time season that he did in the World Rally Championship. You're mates with him. What's, what's he been doing and how hard has it been for him to get back into a full-time role? It's been, it's been very difficult. It's been frustrating for, you know, not only Chris, like any driver, you know, when you're in that bit of a limbo mode from when he finished at Subaru as a works driver. Yeah. Um, he's been you know, driving a, a Skoda, he's been driving all different things, but nothing has been locked in permanently. But, you know, really proud to say that he's going to be with Hyundai for 2014. Yeah. Uh, in amongst a couple of other drivers, they're, they're not doing the whole year with Chris. They're going to share it between three different drivers. And, uh, you know, just good to see him back in a works car. And, uh, you know, we know he won the Asia, Asia Pacific Championship last year. But uh, to get back out there on the world stage and to have him here for Rally Oz is yeah. going to be awesome. Yeah, it's awesome. Uh, obviously, to get a, a factory seat again is what any driver wants. And um, it's been quite a few years since I've been in a, in a factory team. And it's an exciting project, especially with uh, Hyundai, a global manufacturer, coming into the WRC as well. So to be part of the whole, whole effort is fantastic. Coats High Rally Australia is going to be fantastic this year. Obviously, it's been a few years since I've raced at home. Last time we competed, we were... We were leading but um, had to retire with an incident. Um, this year hopefully some better better results and um, just can't wait for that to come around. It's an exciting event in Coffs Harbour and hopefully we get a huge crowd this year. Uh, you need manufacturers in a sport like this to, to support the um, growth and the technology and, and the infrastructure so it's fantastic. Obviously Hyundai coming in, um, you've already got Volkswagen last year and there's talk of Toyota so um, big manufacturers, three of the biggest manufacturers in the world looking at WRC to promote their cars because it's so realistic to what you can buy on the road. Um, it's a big compliment to the sport and hopefully it kickstarts a new, new era where um, everyone's getting into WRC and supporting us. The two clear new drivers that are leading away are Nouvelle, who's my teammate in Hyundai, and uh, then Sebastian Auger, who won the World Championship last year. So um, there's obviously other guys trying to break through into that um, winning um, sort of position, but um, it's, it's not easy in WRC. You need a lot of experience and uh, obviously a lot of skill to compete on all the surfaces and that's what makes the sport so great. Can't wait to see Chris back on our shores, but in terms of the championship, 2013 was a good year for Sebastian's all round. Sebastian OGA yeah. winning in a Volkswagen, the first time in 10 years that Citroen hasn't won a title. It seems like almost the WRC coming back to its glory days a little. It does, you know, and it's, and it's like uh, VW, their first factory effort in the outright category for World Rally Championship. You know, we've seen VW uh, golfs in the past out in, in, in the Group N side of things, but, you know, for them to come out in their first full season and actually dominate like they did with OGA was very yeah. impressive, and it just goes to show the amount of work they did. They've been working on this for two to three years, so, I mean, they've been pretty serious about their launch in 2013 and they came out with a bang and they dominated everybody this year which was fantastic. It's set to be a great season in 2014 and it all kicks off with Rally Monte Carlo on the 13th to the 19th of January. Steve Johnson, thank you. We'll uh, see you all again. Keep checking back on speedcafe.com for more of the Armour All Summer Grill. Each and every day on the Armour All Summer Grill, you've got the chance to win one of these, an Armour All gift pack. For your chance to win, simply click subscribe on speedcafe.com. And congratulations to today's winner. Armour All Custom Shield. Defend against paint chips, scratches, bugs and tar. Easy to apply, easy to remove. Scientifically formulated to resist the weather and elements for up to three months. Armour All Custom Shield, available now.